Hi, my name is Nicole Bernard, and I'm here to give you a brief tutorial on how to use Visley's Teams feature. You can find Teams over here on the left-hand side. We'll begin by clicking on the Join and Create Team button. To join a team, you will need their unique team code. And you'll find the team, and just click here to send a request to an administrator of that team, and you'll get an email once you have been approved. If you would like to create your own team, there's a button here that will set that up for you. We will have a separate tutorial video that will walk you through creating a team and highlight all of the features available to administrators. For now, we'll go over here and look at a team that I'm already a member of. The team page is the overview. Um, so it has the team name, a description, your team join code, and also a logo. It will show you all of the team members who are part of this group. This is also where you would leave the team if you didn't want to be part of it anymore. If you have your own group and are an administrator, there will be a lot of features available to you here to help manage your team. For now, we'll look at shared templates. You have the option to select Facebook or email templates, and we'll start by looking at Facebook. The templates are divided up into folders that you have created. We'll start by looking at team trainings and live parties. We'll click on this template. You have the option to preview those. You can click on this icon here or preview posts and you can click through those easily. If I want to pull that into my personal team gallery, template gallery, I will go ahead and click that button. And a couple of things to note here, Facebook doesn't like things being an exact copy. So we ask that you go in and make a personalization to every template post that you have pulled in. That way Facebook doesn't mark it as spam. And also you are receiving copies of templates and images so any changes you make will not impact the original template. I'll go ahead and import those. And you can see it has been pulled into my personal template gallery and I can go directly there by this button or I can close out and remain here in the Teams page. Now I want to switch to email campaigns. You can see they are also divided into folders. I'll go ahead and look at Hostess Coaching. Again, I have their preview options here. I can see when things are scheduled to be sent out, and I can pull those into my personal gallery. And finally, I want to show you how to share images. All of the images will be divided into folders. These will be organized by the administrators on the, on the team page. You have the ability to go in and um, preview them so you can see them larger. And then you can um, select images and copy them to your gallery. You can select which, which folder from your personal image gallery you'd like those to go into, or you can create a new folder and copy the images. And you can see that those have also been loaded into my image gallery. The Teams feature will really streamline your ability to share content with team members quickly and easily without them needing their own share codes for individual templates. We hope you enjoy this new feature and we're looking forward to working with you. Thank you!